Hi everyone, David here at Sherwood Ford. Drew from Sherwood Ford. And today is Technology Tuesday. Can you believe how fast the weeks go by? It seems like we just did a video and we're doing another one. Did you have a good weekend? Had a great long weekend. Ditto. How about you? Fantastic time, uh, Canada Day. Anyway, we are going to talk today about ePass, that magic wand from Ford that has a lot of really cool technology that helps you uh, achieve greater fuel efficiency, uh, greater ride handling, steering um, control. Steering control. Like it is one of the greatest uh, technology features that Ford came out with a number of years ago. And it's available on most Ford vehicles. Wow. Available on all the new vehicles other than Super Duty and Transit. So F-150s, Escapes, Focus, yep. um, Explorer, right. the list goes on. Everybody's asking, what the heck is E-Pass? Yes. Uh, electronic power assisted steering. Yep. So this electric power assisted steering system is going to change the way you drive a Ford forever. Come on over here a little bit closer. We're going to go underneath the hood for a minute. And we're going to point out some of the fluids. For example, radiator fluid. Yep. Uh, over on this side here, uh, washer fluid. Washer fluid. Oh, what's on the back over there? Back here we got brake fluid. Brake fluid. Uh, the ones that we can't see, uh, oil and uh, transmission. sealed transmission. Right. Yes. So, ladies and gentlemen, what is the one fluid that we didn't point out? Power steering fluid. Hydraulic power steering fluid. There's no pump. There's no hoses. There's no fluid. It's electric. Right. So, what is it really all about? Like EPAS is an electric system that does what? It, uh, I mean, it works instead of a hydraulic pump to provide power steering for your vehicle. Um, when it's needed. When it's needed, exactly. Not so, continuously running. Well, I, I mean, it is in the sense that it's going to provide you with that quick, nice, easy, not a pain in the butt to turn the wheel. Sure, when I'm in the parking lot and I'm maneuvering my vehicle, it's going to be nice and light nice touch. And smooth, nice and light. But Drew, I'm going down the highway, straight as an arrow. Yep. I don't really need power steering. No. So, in those cases, you're going to have the system not fully engaged, like you don't really need it. Right. Highway speed, you're going to be a little firmer. It's not going to move around as much as in a parking lot at a slow speed. That's right. So, as a result of an electric power assisted steering that's electronic, we now have some capabilities with the vehicle that you wouldn't ordinarily find in a hydraulic system. What would be the first cool feature? Well, I mean, we've talked about it in the past. We did a demo a couple weeks ago. Uh, park Assist, Active Park Assist. Yeah. So that's a feature that with a, a regular hydraulic power um, steering controls, that's impossible. It doesn't work. Yep. But with the electronic steering, um, all of a sudden we can have the car park itself. Absolutely. Programmable. One. Programmable. Exactly. So electric power steering. Here's another one. And, and you know what? You've probably experienced this yourself. You're going down the highway and the wind is blowing nice and steady. Think Lethbridge. Yeah. It's yeah, in exactly. Alberta, right? Yeah. And your vehicle, you're always fighting it. You're always fighting that wind to try and stay in the lane nice and straight. Yes. So now with drift pull compensation from the whether how much effect it needs yep. um, it's constantly checking every second is checking it's not like it's sure. taking over it's never going to take over yep. but it's constantly checking to see if there's anything that the system can do to help provide you with easier right. steering right it is offering responsive steering assist you could say i guess to, yeah. to help maintain your direction right uh, the other thing that we're, that the vehicle features in the e-pass system is something they call active control yes <laughs> Not it's, really that kind of nibble. I mean, no, they call it, a, it's a funny term, right? Yeah. Um, you know, I was used to driving an old vehicle in the past, and you sit there and you're, you're constantly going back and forth with the wheel as you get little bumps and little swerves in the road. Feel those vibrations coming vibrations through, the steering through the wheel. And what the system does, active nibble control, it just smooths that all out. Yep. So that, that steering wheel stays nice and straight for you. It's not jerking all over the place, and it keeps your vehicle in a straight line. Absolutely. So, again, the system is continually learning and adapting to the road conditions. Um, so over a period of time, you're going to have uh, less to compensate for those changes in the road, in the wind, uh, that sort of thing. Right. right. Um, and again, delivering improved fuel economy, greater maneuverability, and uh, improved ride handling. Yeah. Great. Is there anything else about the e-pass system? That basically covers that. I, I think mean, it's going to save money too. 
No more hydraulic fluid to change, no more belts, no more hoses. You never you have just to save think about cost it. on maintenance. Exactly. Right? It's Perfect. kind of a win win. And you should really come down to Sherwood Ford and try it out. We're at 2540 Broadmoor Boulevard in Sherwood Park. Or give us a call. 780-449-3673. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you'd like to see in the next Tech Tuesday video. Otherwise, boom. Have yourselves a giant day. Have a giant day. Bye for now.